Hi, good morning. That's a little shootout between the Kensington, the Romney's export, and the Singleton super metal, uh, silver, silver snuff. They are all made by the Scandinavian Tobacco Group. I like all of them, all three, equally, even though they are different. They have a certain, each of them has a certain uh, difference, a certain, certain special flavor. Start with the cleanest one, uh, Silver Snuff X Super Menthol. That was the first, the first English tobacco uh, snuff that you could get in Germany back in the 1960s from what people told me and from what I read back in 61 or something like this. Yeah, this was the first imported one. All three are made by the Scandinavian Tobacco Group, made in, I think it's made in um, Denmark. Quite sure. And I guess I know which factory it is, but if you don't know it, don't talk about it. If you know it, tell me. I think it's that one. Okay, so <laughs> Singleton. Um, I made a little, I, I took a few notes because I want to stay below five minutes and I will not try and because they are similar but not, okay? So, uh, mentholated, yes, four out of five, three, four out of five, um, eucalyptus, two out of five, and camphor, two out of five, no additional flavor, this is very clean, very nice if you get up in the morning, you want to freshen up, or you go to bed and you want to clean your nose, this one is perfect. It's not too strong, yeah? Very nice, uh, a bit of toasted flavor. All, all these three have a toast, toasted um, tobacco flavor. Uh, apparently burly, okay? This is what, what the manufacturer says. Now, of course, they don't tell you the truth. Next one, Kensington. This one is high on everything. <laughs> uh, high on menthol, it's a, five out of five uh, eucalyptus five out of five no camphor but lavender lavender in the background a bit of citrusy uh, and also toasted flavor i love this one it's uh, quite quite a cleaner yeah so you have to be careful with this usually it's if you if you use this method it will be too too much yeah better pinch it pinch and carefully okay Nice one. And Romney's export, not Dr. Romney, Romney's export snuff. Menthol, five out of five. Eucalyptus, two out of five. Camphor, two out of five. It has an additional lemon zesty flavor and it's again a toasted, uh, toasted flavor. This is very, actually quite complex, I have to say, because it starts with, with uh, um, tobacco, uh, you know, the toast, dry toast kind of flavor then it develops it goes through these different tastes and then and it's it's a long lasting comparably long lasting freshness that you have it's like um it's like uh like a chewing gum for your nose but but really like like uh, not not spearmint it's not the sweet one right so these two are comparably similar with the thing with the difference that the Kensington, this one has no camphor, no camphor. This one does have camphor. And if you don't believe me, I can, if you want, I link you a site. Because in Germany, at least that's what I know. In Germany, the manufacturers have to tell you what is inside. Not exactly what kind of flavoring they use, because that's another topic. They can always stay below the 0.5% and say some kind of flavor, and they do it. They stay under 0.5% and then they add those magic ingredients in, in it. And uh, here you can get for these three, definitely, and all for all the Peschels and all the Bernard, you can get the ingredients list and you can see how much menthol how much eucalyptus how much um, camphor is inside and uh, in percent or in milligrams okay so uh, have a nice one oh this one has a menthol and 
and eucalyptus and camphor in it, okay? So five minutes, yay. Have a nice one, bye bye.